what's going on everybody and welcome back today we're going to go ahead and cover the 1.21 update for call of duty modern warfare before we even jump into that though please do hook me up like the video subscribe to the channel and follow me on twitter in the background i got some call of duty modern warfare gameplay as normal so please enjoy that as we go ahead and get right to it okay so let's start out with the playlist update for modern warfare in regard to that we have the realism mosh pit you got the reinforced ground war game mode you got core ground war you got the blueprint gunfight only game mode arsenal 9 the face-off map that's the new map and hard hat 24 7 baby on the other side of things in the war zone we have battle royale solos battle royale trios the battle royale quads and the blood money quad is finally here as well okay to start out with the warzone update you have the armor box which is the new addition to the game mode it's going to be the same as the munitions box but instead of bullets you're going to get armor plates you can use this for only you or you can use this for the entire team it's going to be crucial when it comes to the late game so definitely get your hands on one you can buy it at the uh, buy station or you can go ahead and loot it off the ground as well moving on it looks like the devs went ahead and put back in the most wanted contract but this time around they didn't remove anything else and they reduced the time from five minutes to three minutes so it's a little bit more viable and it's a little bit more balanced because that gives people less time to go somewhere and get set up now for the big one the loot update this new update added the new SKS legendary weapon and updated five new blueprints that are around the map. The AX-50, the Kilo 141, the FAL, the MP7, the AUG, the Gulag has been updated. Yo, you can now get ARs, assault rifles, and SMGs in the Gulag. This is gonna change the game. I'm telling you, they heard me. They must've watched my video because this is exactly what I wanted. They added the M4, the AK-47, the M13, the SCAR is back, baby. The Ram 7, the MP7, the AUG, the P90, and the Striker 47. They're all now scattered around the map and are in legendary crates. So they just basically took this to a whole new level and we didn't even get to season four yet. Yo, I'm hype. I'm definitely big hype now. We do got to keep it moving though. So furthermore in that the devs went ahead and fixed a lot of exploits with this patch. Wow, it's a big patch and unfortunately it's going to take up a lot of memory but it adds so much more value to the game. They fixed all the exploits surrounding what we know of right now in the war zone. That means all the exploits are being immune to the gas. That means the gulag exploits, the getting under the map exploits are completely fixed. The UI code is a little bit better and things should go a little bit smoother. In addition to that, they also did a couple of weapon patches. This list is long and I'm not reading down this entire thing. So I will definitely have the link to the full list down below so check that out season three is coming to a close and it's crazy because they just added a bunch of new stuff to the game mode and the fact that they just fixed a bunch of exploits i'm looking forward to seeing what we're going to get in season four i made a video concerning it seeing what we want what we don't want what we want to see moving forward if you want you can check that out in the description box below as well i am looking forward this game has legs and it has a lot of support behind it so i'm looking forward to seeing where we go from here but that's literally about it when it comes to the update. If you can, do me that favor, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and follow me on Twitter. That all being said, I appreciate you coming out to watch my video, and I will see you on the next one.